Monday um I, I don't even know where to really begin but I'm just gonna jump right in there um I am sitting in my job's parking lot um I don't start to 8 30 so it's like 7 58 and I just wanted to come on here and talk to you guys really quick um quick update so I haven't vlogged um I posted a video probably a few days maybe even a week ago and I haven't really vlogged since then um the re the reason why I haven't vlogged is because I just it's not that I've been too busy or or anything like that I just really haven't had any motivation to vlog if that makes sense and some other things just been going on on top of that as well so i haven't picked up the camera to vlog um i will go ahead and tell y'all as far as you know with me working full time and you know the reason why i made the decision to go back full time um many of y'all probably don't know and some of y'all do know you know um marcus was working full-time well is still working full-time and he's employed at walmart he's a manager and i was working part-time um so basically about a month and a half ago um by me working part-time hours you know i was able to make my own schedule come in when i wanted to come in basically like that and some stuff had went down at my job and it was becoming like extremely stressful for me um like the devil y'all was really attacking me in the department that i was in i'm not going to go into full details in regards of it because you know although this is my channel and you know it really doesn't matter who sees it i'm just not gonna go into full details about it because i feel like god delivered me from that department for for a reason so i will say in the midst of me going through them trials in that department you know our income really it started to affect our income where times where it was hard um we didn't know you know as far as like grocery shopping i would say we didn't we were starting to run low um almost not making it to our next check and you know my husband is an amazing husband you guys like he takes care of everything he pays majority of the bills and you know i pay a couple of bills and you know keep up on the house um house things and i keep up on the kids like clothes shoes whatever you name it so it started to become hard because you know my husband you know he pays the rent well we go half and half but he pays our electric our gas our water bill our phone bill and um you know i help out where i need to help out because my husband wanted to this is what he told me that he wanted to do that he had it and most of y'all know how men are when they say they got it they don't like anybody to tell them otherwise so as being me being his wife i said okay um i'll you know not going to keep pushing you on it and pressuring you on it i decided to let you know that's what he wanted to do so it started to become hard financially because even though he decided to take care of those things with me working part-time the hours i was working 
and of course getting bonuses or whatnot each month it was it will make it, it was making up for a full-time check basically so example if i only work 50 hours because i would you know get paid every two weeks my checks will still be enough to equal up to if i was working 80 hours if that makes sense for some of y'all so when that it, it became a trial it became a real trial for us because it was starting to you know affect my income and affecting my income mean meaning he had to start taking up a lot of my slack because of what my job was doing to me so i decided to go full-time now with me being full-time you guys um this was a, a hard decision for me to make and i've cried about it um i know i've came on here and vlogged it like you know this is gonna be awesome and stuff like that but i'm gonna be real with you you guys this has been a test it has been hard it has been hard on my household it has been hard on Marcus it has been hard on my kids it has been hard on me when I tell y'all that you know going from being able to you know go to work and leave and still be able to um, come home when you want to and see your kids and and also work you know that is so awesome like I I've never had a job where I could just leave and not have to tell anybody that I was leaving as long as I just did my requirements and that was that it became extremely hard um this last month really hard because I I have to you know I work from 8 30 to 5 as y'all know school is about to start and I don't know how this is going to be because MJ, this is his first year of kindergarten and I really want to be there for all his moments, special moments. Like I just, I really want to be there and it's really been taking a toll on me as a mother because I had to make a decision financially to be able to help my husband out and also to be able to take care of my children so for me to make this decision of going full-time I knew what was going to you know happen but I didn't think it was going to have a big effect on me like it is now um you know having three kids being a full-time mom trying to do this YouTube and just trying to do everything else as, you know, a woman, it's hard for me. It's, it's been, like, really stressful. Um, I haven't talked to any of my, like, friends or whatnot. I've distanced myself from everybody, basically. You know, I've distanced myself because when I feel like when I feel like things are weighing down on me, I just, I shut down. And I, I was working on that, you know, working on opening up, working on talking, working on not being so closed in. But lately, I just feel like life has been getting the best of me. And this is not no, you know, sad vlog. This is not no oh, I want somebody to feel sorry for me. This is just, you know, me giving y'all an update of what's been going on with me and why I've been MIA. Um, you know, this position that I decided to take on, it's a lot. Um, I went to the overview and half of the stuff that I'm doing now was not discussed during the overview. And what I mean by overview, meaning like, you know, when you already work for a company and they post a position, they really try to get people that's already, you know, internally there versus externally. So when I went to the overview to learn about the position, you know, I was given, I was, you know, I was told what I would be doing, but not to the extent of what I'm doing now. So me trying to still go through training and get and retain all this information <clears throat> it's it's been taking a toll on me i've been doing it you know i've been coming to work you know being as positive as i can 
I'm very grateful for my job. I'm very grateful for this opportunity, for this position. Um, financially, I'm very grateful for it because this is what I needed to do for my family. Not once did I want to stop vlogging. Not once did I want to, you know, just be away from my kids. But y'all, it is so hard on me at this time because, you know, I know most of y'all um work long hours um some may work 16 12 to 16 hours you know but for me you know me personally it's hard on me because my kids are only 10 7 and 5 and for eight hours of the day although they're out of school you know i'm at work my husband is at home he works midnights he has to be able to monitor them and on top of that get sleep so this was a decision that a, a opportunity presented itself to me and because me and marcus are you know we do everything together we discuss everything together we are you know we are husband and we are wife, husband and wife and because this opportunity presented itself financially, I jumped on it because I got tired of, you know, basically trying to stretch food, um, basically trying, you know, manage our bills. And I just got tired of it. And, you know, it's still a it's still a trial in the air because we still got things we got to get caught up on. However, I just wanted to be make it a little bit easier and not be so stressed out um i just been like like out of out of body i haven't i just really just been out of out of my body and i don't know i don't know it's you know it's it's really been like hard it's really been like hard so you know my computer is down I haven't been able to really put a lot into my channel as far as creating thumbnails and I really haven't been able to do so because my computer is down. I don't have a laptop. I have a tablet, but my tablet is outdated. So, you know, with that, heck, with with that, you know, I haven't been able to, um, you know, really do the things that I need to do as far as my tablet is concerned. Um, it, it's just been a lot, y'all. Like, it, it's been a lot, and... I'm just like I don't know some days I don't know if I'm coming or I'm going um I don't know I don't know you know like I want to I want to put a lot into my YouTube channel it's not just for me about the subscribers or the numbers, but I do want to see. I'm, I will be alive if I say I don't want to see my channel grow. Um, I will be alive if I if I said that you know. It it bothers me, you know. I will be alive if I said it, that it didn't because I don't have a a camera. You know what I'm saying? I don't have the light the lighting. I don't. It's certain things that I don't have. And I know, you know, you have to work with what you got, but it's it's been a year, y'all. Like, let, let's who who am I fooling? It's been a year, and it's certain stuff that you need in order to improve your YouTube channel. Like, it's it's certain stuff that I need, and I don't have the money to do it, you know. And even if I was to, you know, get a camera and stuff like that, my computer is still down. You know, I need my camera to upload. Like, you can't just upload from your camera. I mean, if there's a camera here that you can't upload from, you know, please let me know. But to my knowledge, there is no camera out here that can just upload from the camera. You have to be able to hook it to something. 
you know, Marcus, we is in the process of getting a computer towards, you know, the end of this year, a newer computer. I don't know what kind of computer that we're going to get. He's been looking. Um, he's supposed to be getting a, he gets a big bonus from his job every year around Christmas time. So he's in the process of getting us a computer because not only do we need a computer, but my kids got to have access to a computer due to the fact of the type of stuff that they do at their school. They got to be able to be on the computer at home. So we're in the process of that. You know, we're in the process of getting a laptop, <clears throat> a computer and a laptop. And a computer laptop basically for, you know, YouTube purposes and, you know, other things or whatnot. But I'm just like on edge a little bit and I need a pick me upper. I need to pick me up or um, lately as a woman, you know, in certain things that I need and I haven't been able to do those things because I've been so focused on providing and, you know, being a mom. I know a lot of y'all, um, you know, a lot of you don't see my kids a lot on my vlogs. I'm trying to you know, put them in my vlogs more because that's what my channel is about, Mommy of Three. And the only reason why I don't put my kids in there all the time is because we don't be doing nothing. You know what I'm saying? Like, they don't be doing anything. They just be playing, reading. Like, they don't really be doing anything. And we don't really go anywhere. You know, we are a homebody type of family. So, I really don't be vlogging a lot with my kids and it's not that I'm ashamed of my kids. It's not that I don't want my kids on my vlogs, but we really don't be doing anything and I don't want my channel just to be based on the same constant thing, just same. I want to see different stuff, you know, because that's the type of person that I am. You know, when I watch other people vlogs, you know, I like to see different stuff and you know, I have ideas or whatnot, and I'm trying to come out of my shell more with YouTube, with vlogging, you know, vlogging in public, um, not being so concerned about what people got to say or how people looking at me. It, you know, I just, it's, it's a lot that's been going through my mind. So I'm sorry if it seems like I'm rambling, I'm all over the place, but I'm just, I'm just kicking it with y'all, you know, letting y'all know what's been up especially as far as the update as far as with me and work and why I haven't vlogged and you know certain people has reached out to me and it's just you know trying to financially get myself back together um it's life you go through it I'm going through it and I'm just trying to you know just keep my head above the water y'all so let me know you know just just let me know like how did y'all get through it you know i my channel is a small channel um i know i can do hauls you know i like i said i have a lot of ideas and i'd be like literally sitting there like i can do this and i can do that but i'm scared like i i just haven't posted like i would do stuff like I can do a lot and you know Marcus be trying to get me out there and I, I don't know what's stopping me I don't know what's stopping me and then with me working full time I'm like you know what can I like I told him what can I really put on my channel because I'm at work for eight hours of the day I can't vlog at work, you know, and I'm not going to vlog at work. Like, I'm just not going to do that, but I don't know. So, I just wanted to come on here and give y'all an update. Now, I know I'm looking around. It's just, you know, everybody's starting to pull in for work, and I always like to look around. I don't care where I'm at. I just like to look around my surroundings, but... Just let me know or some tips or anything that helped you guys or help y'all to overcome y'all camera fear of vlogging in public or, you know, how do you, you know, if you don't have a camera, 
how did you really make it work how long did it take for you to get a camera um discounts or anything like what did y'all do like i i want my channel to grow i can talk to my husband about it but you know he's a man so his channel of course is 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 blooming like i'm not gonna even i was just commenting on um danae's uh vlogs about how his channel is just blooming like views subscribers like my husband is out here but he does sports you know what i'm saying like he doesn't vlog like i like i vlog he doesn't do that on his channel so i mean he talks and you know periscope and he do all of that but it's mainly about sports so i don't know what to do i'm still trying to learn how to really vlog you know uh my editing has gotten better i'm still working on that certain music certain you know because i'm working off my phone so i'm really trying to you know when i edit try to do different stuff so it it won't be just at a standstill but i don't know like i really contemplating so many times of just quitting youtube because i'm like you know is this really for me like i like the vlog but it's like me really doing it you know i can watch you know the bells plus one and i can watch danae and i can watch one cup um one cup with one cup one cup a day one y'all know what i'm who i'm talking about um veronica i you know she changed her name too so i i can get on here and watch them and be like dang you know like i can do that you know i have personality i'm silly i'm goofy but why can't i just put it on youtube you know i'm not being fake about it but i think i'm just scared i don't know if i'm just scared of certain people reaction i really don't know what was stopping me i don't know that's why i haven't really been consistent like i don't i really don't know y'all so that's just my thoughts on top of what's been going on and the update and I'm probably going to go a little bit more into details um, on what, what else has been going on with me. But as of right now, it's like 8.20. I got 10 minutes. I got a clock in. So I will talk to you guys later. Um, definitely, like I said, it's, it's Monday. Have a good day today. And I will talk to you guys soon. Peace.